Hello everyone and welcome to another guitar lesson. Today I want to talk about the cage system and I want to show you how I like to connect the C shape to the A shape and the G shape to the E shape. I know that everybody knows how to play an E shape bar chord so I will start with that. Okay, And uh, right now I'm playing an A chord using the E shape and this is an A chord because the root is here at the 5th fret last string, that's an A okay? now I like to use this image I consider that to be the peak of the mountain okay? and on that side of the mountain this is the, my peak, right? and on this side, the bridge side I can play a knee shape bar chord but if I want to look at the other side of the mountain, this side, the nut side, well, there I can play a G shape. All I have to do is changing the finger I use to play the root. If I use my index, I will use the E shape. If I use my pinky to play exactly the same note, I will use the G shape and of course you can use this on the first string right again that's an A so that's my E shape bar chord and that's my G shape bar chord and this is very useful when you are soloing because you can easily go and jump around using the two shapes okay now we can do exactly the same with the C shape and the A shape so let's stay here at the 5th fret, okay? But this time we will need to use the 5th string. Okay, so what note is that? That's a D note, right? Okay, so on the bridge side of the mountain I can play a D chord using the A shape. Okay, and you see I'm using my index here. Now, if I play that D note with my pinky I can play a D chord using the C shape and that's how I like to connect my C shape bar chords to the A shape bar chords okay. that's always true doesn't matter where you are if you're here that's a G G with the index means A shape G with a pinky C shape Okay, I think this is super easy, right? And I, I hope that you will find this useful to visualize your chord shapes on the fretboard. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell. And if you're looking for more guitar lessons, go to my website www.robertodallavecchia.com or you can uh, join my instructional channel on Truefire. It's called Fret Picking Experience. Again, thank you for watching. And I will see you in the next video.